hi guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to the channel so today I'm going to go to Target and I'm going to go and do some feminine hygiene products there's this one specific product that I really want to try and it's from um, what is it called honey pot it's this is my fit for the day I'm just wearing simple outfit a hat because my hair is looking all a mess but yes you guys let's go straight into Target and see what they have so I'm over here let's by go. the feminine section and I saw everybody talking about these honey pot products um, this is the feminine wash they only have one scent right now um, I think this it says normal foaming wash it says plant-based feminine care I see everybody talking about these so I really want to give this a try and I don't really use feminine wash to be honest but because they have such great review I'm thinking about trying these and they also have the intimate uh, this these are like wipes and this one is the wipes too and they have this sense to send to for sensitive this one over here is just normal wipes they also have a panty spray I don't know what I would be doing with a panty spray but that's what that is and this one is also lavender and this is a panty, panty spray too this one is jasmine and they also have some bath bombs but that's all you can tell that people are buying these because this old section is gone so I don't even know what was here but all I know is all gone so they even have these over here too what are what are these as it says coconut oil um so what is this for men soothing plant based what is this I don't even know and then they have this over here too this is this is like some supplements so these are all the honey pots that they have in here and I really really want to try so I think I'm just gonna try this even though I don't use these normally but let's see what this does this is for eight dollars and ninety nine cents and the price is not too bad the bath bombs are the most expensive so far and they are for twelve ninety nine so I'm just gonna try this and yeah these are just the regular summer eaves I don't I don't really use these so I can't give you a review but also up here this brand I use the L brand I do use and they have some what are these these look like wipes and this is like a, a wash also and then they have the good wash up here never tried those before let me know if you have but I've heard a lot about honey pot I'm really thinking about trying this panty spray I don't even know what I would use that for spray my panties for what but I guess it's necessary if they make it so yeah you guys let's keep on shopping so look you guys they even have the pads that these are the tampons and they have the pads too so this honey pot brand seems to be one it says 100 percent dual pack tampons so I think it's 100 percent organic so I think I think I think you know I want to give this a try I use these down here like I said before these are the one that I use in their organic cotton tamp um, pads too I use the pads but this honey pot has been getting a lot of raves so I want to try something from it yes over here they have the um let's see what is this panty liners right here they have panty liners here they have organic panty liners so I think this is but this one is the one that I love these so let's keep on shopping guys I just wanted to share that part with you because I've heard a lot about this honey pot brand and of course I have to give it a try because I'm big on feminine hygiene so yeah you guys the, the, I have not even seen these before either these are flex have you tried these diva cups let me know in the comments and let me know what your experience with them are but this is from salt and this one looks like it's organic one size ocean menstrual cups um i don't see nothing like if it's organic or not but these looks really nice it says soft soft cups so i've not tried these before but i want to give them a try though because i heard that they're they're better for you and 
um, it's good on the environment you don't have to be disposing your um, stuff all the time so I want to give this a try this is the flex one and this one also is another one from soft soft side so yeah guess I'll share that with you, with you guys also let me know if you have tried any of these that I'm showing today so and let me know in advance before I buy if you like them or not so let me know guys stumble up on this brand called flamingo let me know if you have tried this before this is like a, um, a body cream and this is like the lotion and they also have a light hydrating spray let me know if you have tried flamingo before I only see one only one scent but it smells really nice and fresh so let me know if you have tried flamingo before in the comments okay okay so i've heard a lot about these la roche posay they have a bunch of products too these are like skincare still but i've heard a lot of but uh, i see that they have a lot of stuff for eczema and stuff let me know if you have tried this brand also i'm very curious about this actually because like i said i've heard a lot a lot of good reviews on these a lot of people always talk about the wipes and they talk about a serum that they have i don't know they talk about a serum that they have also maybe it's this one right here this one right here so so this is like um it says dermatologist we are um recommend so this la rose jose they have a lot of things i heard a lot of good stuff about them let's see what's over here never seen this before milk melt is this milk cosmetics don't let me nah i don't think it's milk cosmetics but yeah these are new too to my i love this you guys they have the the aztec clay i have a big jar of this in my house because i use it on my hair I use it on my face you can have mix it with um apple cider vinegar to wash your hair you can put it on your face so i really really like those and of course one of my best favorite brand in here is bliss because they're just really good so yeah you guys let's keep on shopping look you guys a scent hives has a facial wash it says it's new should i try this leave skin instantly hydrated and glowy you know what i think i think i'm gonna try this and they also have what is this um this is like a hydrating so i guess it's an oil-free face moisturizer oh that's cool that's pretty cool it's an avocado and this one is in watermelon i'm gonna try this face wash because i love scent eyes like i always say that i always get their apricot scrubs but I get it in TJ Maxx because I get it for cheaper. But this is pretty cool. I didn't know Santa has uh, new stuff like that. So I'm going to try that out too, guys. Okay, so over here, this is like a natural brand. But this is new to my TJ Maxx. And they have some serums here. Some cleansers. Niacinamide. Oh my gosh, this has niacinamide in there. It's one of the best gold standard for... Um, for um, anti-aging and they have down here a lot of product plant ceramides ceramides are good for the skin keep it moisturized and stuff so this is new they even have a retinol up here you guys retinol complex serum I wonder what I wonder how much percent retinol is, is in there it don't say but I know it's a little bit pricey because it's like 20 bucks 25 bucks so it's a little bit pricier but hmm, this is new let me know if you have tried this before okay so birds bees birds bees as uh, some new micellar water and toner they're rose scented they smell, they smell really good and they have like a um aloe vera and a cucumber also so i've not tried these before they even have the wipes let me know if you guys like birds bees they're they're supposed to be natural they're a little bit pricier than the regular stuff but i've tried like their lip balms before and they're really really good and i tried these up here too 
and they're really really good my favorite is the um is the which is the red one let me see so it has to be like the pomegranate i think that's the one that i tried though so they have some more up here too they're really really good and they have some some mask also i love birds bees oh pacifica this is another brand that i've heard a lot about you know what i'm gonna try one of these facial masks because i've heard and this is like a rose rose peptide facial mask so i'm gonna try this they also have a row uh, mist and this is this is like a makeup remover but i'm gonna try the mask i've heard so much about pacifica so they even have like a a wipe over here and they have different scents too this one right here is like a, it says wake up beautiful so this is what <clears throat> microblading patch i don't know about that um so they have a few this, they have, this is a face wash and it's like an overnight cream but i'm definitely gonna give this um face um peptide face mask and this one is for 3 dollars but I've heard a lot about Pacifica. And they have this little thing that you used to roll, roll your face with. And they have, these are what? These are lip balms. Look at these lip balms, you guys. Those are different. But yeah, Pacifica, I've heard a lot about them too. Yeah. Down here, they have some more stuff. 2% salicylic acid so if you have like bad acne salicylic acid is good for it they even have a vegan collagen eye recovery eye cream they have a few oh they even have one this is another cruelty free oh they have all their stuff for cruelty free no i don't think so but i I'm gonna try the other one and then test it out and see if I like it and if my skin reacts very well to it then then I'll try other stuff they even have this glycolic they have like a glycolic line so here you guys I'm gonna try these we have the high mask yeah it's called Pacifica this this is a um, vegan collagen as arrived so I guess these are the new the new stuff for vegans so I'm excited to try this so let's keep on shopping that's gonna be it for this video because I'm kind of in a rush so don't forget to like comment subscribe and I'll see you in my next video guys bye